All right. So welcome again to Military Guna TV. Thank you very much for joining me. And we're going to speak about former head coach of the Reggae Boys, Theodore Tapper Whitmore. Hmm. What is the latest on Theodore Tapper Whitmore? Surprisingly, <laughs> this one is quite surprising. I'm being honest. Um, I wasn't expecting um, it as well. Uh, Tapper Whitmore to Mount Pleasant as the head coach um, of Mount Pleasant FC. Uh, Mount Pleasant Academy, yeah, I, I think I, yeah, Mount Pleasant Academy. But nonetheless, um, this is something big. I would say, I would definitely say, it is something big. So hopefully, you guys are doing good. I would really appreciate it if you guys smash that like button. So let's get straight into the details. I won't waste any one of you guys' time. This, this is not a time for time wasting, actually. So the stars reported. The star reported this morning. Whitmore Ferguson heading to Mount Pleasant. Hmm. For those who don't know Ferguson, well, you guys are going to get more details on it. And I, 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 I really believe that I saw something like this coming for Ferguson. Very good tactical coach. Really good tactical coach. Um, um, for those who don't know Ferguson, um, he was the coach of the Jamaica College Manning Cup team. All right, so let's get straight to the details. No more wasting time. Let me see if I can enlarge the screen so yeah, you guys can see it a little bit better, I believe. No thanks right here. Um, good. Uh, let's get straight to the details. No more tarrying. Um, the Star Report um, Sports have been reliably informed that former National Cinnamon's football team head coach Theodore Tapper Whitmore. Um, <clears throat> will take charge of Mount Pleasant Football Academy with Jamaica College JC coach Davian Ferguson as his assistant for the upcoming Jamaica Premier League season. All right. Hey, <laughs> let me tell you something. Um, I'm very much I'm enthused about this because we're going to get the opportunity to see Tapa Whitmore on a different level of coaching. We're going to get to see that. And for me personally, I do, I do wish him do well. I wish, I wish he, he would do well. Um, now, this is what I, I, I many people are asking for. We we have the, we have Tapa Whitmore coach. What has he done as a coach? Now, this is his opportunity. Actually, I think he should be very much enthused about this opportunity, taking up this challenge in coming to perform at this level on a more consistent basis, not a one time or a two time thing, but on a consistent base basis an anonymous source close to the negotiations say the arrangement with the two coaches are all but complete and they just need to put pen um need to put pen to paper but while whitmore comes into the job free of obligations having not coached since he was relieved of his duties as reggae boys head coach in december ferguson is still employed at jc and seeks the blessings of the school's hierarchy to get that done i would assume now, for those who don't know um, um, Ferguson, Davian Ferguson, a very good coach. He has been coaching for a long while now. Um, it is also understood that the 2019 Manning Cup winning coach wants to complete the schoolboy football season before joining Mount Pleasant. That's a strange one. That's really a strange one. I, I, I wouldn't agree with that. I, I wouldn't want definitely get this is a big opportunity for him. He has done a lot at schoolboy level, so why um, stick around? <clears throat> Why maybe he wants to prove himself a bit more. I don't know. But that, that's that's kind of strange for me. Currently, they are talking to the club. The source said negotiations are about 95% complete, but until everything is completed, that is where they are. So the contracts of both coaches are still being worked out and will continue through this week. But a gentleman's agreement is already in place, and they expect they will be putting pen to paper by the first of august so that's what five days from now five five days from now apart from ass um, assisting with more ferguson will be will be charged with re reorganizing the structure of the club of which his ownership has serious concern okay um he said that jamaica college are good and don't have an issue but that is the only outstanding thing agreed on the source he said <clears throat> If either of two parties object to the proposed agree, um, arrangement, Ferguson may be forced to make a decision. Although everyone is confident a decision will be reached. Um, I do think that Ferguson should, should just make this move and not to stick around about schoolboy football. This is a bigger step. Yes, maybe you want to 
I don't know, maybe um, a little bit more experience at the lower level. I'm not sure. Whitmore led the reggae boys to the 2022 World Cup qualifiers, but was fired after a string of poor results. During his time in charge, he also wanted Ferguson as an assistant. Okay, so long time he's been voting for Ferguson, um, but that did not materialize. Mount Pleasant started last season with Englishman Wally Downs, but turned to his <laughs> compatriot, Nicky Eden, mid midway the campaign. Yeah, he was having a good um, season. Even he didn't really finish his season well as also, but uh, based on the talent that they have, you'd expect minimum. Uh, well, they, they did went to semi finals, yeah, they did went to semi finals. Uh, mm, uh, I'm not sure, but at the base of the talent and the money spent, I do think that they should be in top two, um, into the finals, base of money spent. Um, anyways. Although the team made it to the JPL quarterfinals, they see the quarterfinals. They lost the Cavaliers um, on penalties. Carl Simone Pleasant for a comment on the situation went unanswered. That is it. That is it. That is it. That is it. <laughs> that is it. Um, so, people, uh, so that's it, people. Theodore Tapa Whitmore on his way. Hmm, why did I do it like that? On his way to. to to, to be the head coach of Mount Pleasant Football Academy. This is a huge thing. I, I personally believe this, this is a big deal. Um, hopefully, we'll see how this one materialize going forward. So, people, go into the comment section. Tell me what you think about that. Before you leave, smash the like button, hit the subscribe button. I do think Ferguson should just give up on schoolboy football. You have, you, have, you have done a lot at that level already. There's no need to hold on to anything. Um, but definitely, this is a big opportunity for you um, to go in a, 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 at a senior level. At a senior, senior level. Um, I'm not sure, not, I'm not, I can't even remember if he did that already. But anyways, people, smash the like button. Tell me what you think about this story. And what you think about Tapa Whitmore going to official coaching week in, week out. So for a person who don't like interviews, unfortunately, you will, you will face a lot of interviews this time around. Once you're in JPL, remember that JPL are doing a lot of interviews now. So it's a new structure, new format. Anyways, people, smash the like button, hit subscribe button if you're here for the first time. Until next time, Mount Pleasant FC tentatively getting a new coach in the likes of former head coach of the Reggae Boys, Theodore Tapa Whitmore, legend of the Jamaica football um, pedigree, I would say. Until next time, people, we're out. Hit the like button, hit the share button, and most definitely, subscribe.